With the Resident Evil 4 remake finally being released and having such a success, it's inevitable that we will definitely be getting a release at some point for the Separate Ways DLC starring Ada Wong. Here's how we would love for Separate Ways to play out and what we would like to see happen in it. We'd like to see how Ada Wong arrives to Spain, seeing her perspective of maybe seeing Leon during the village fight, similar to the original RE4. One little nice homage we'd like to see is the Ganada wearing Leon's jacket, just like in the original Separate Ways. We would also like to see more scenes with Ada and Luis and their deal they had with Luis complying and getting a Las Plagas sample for her. We did see some emails between the two later on in Luis's lab, and maybe we could also see what umbrella files were taken. Also seeing more dialogue between Ada and Albert Wesker like in the original as well, by having Wesker asking for Ada to get rid of Leon or complain that Leon is becoming a nuisance and getting agitated with Ada for not finishing Leon off. Later in the DLC, Albert sends Krauser to dispose of Leon, but along the way, Ada interferes and they have a little knife fight. What we don't want, though, is a fight with Krauser where Ada finishes him off after the final fight with Leon and Krauser, like in the original RE4. We felt as if the final fight between Leon and Krauser in RE4 Remake was Krauser's definitive end in death. The fight between Ada and Krauser could be prior to Leon and Krauser's knife fight after Luis is attacked. We feel if they have Krauser come back after the final confrontation with him and Leon to then fight Ada, it would diminish the overall tone and emotional feels that were established in the main game with his death at the hands of Leon. During RE4 Remake, we see Ada notice Ashley being taken away by Verdugo. It then fades to black. This could be because Ada goes after Verdugo to maybe save Ashley, but on the way she gets stopped by Pisanta, the black-robed one. Verdugo is in the red robe. Being as to how the original U3 was cut from RE4 Remake, they have changed the lore into U3 being Pisanta. They could have a special boss fight with Ada versus U3 that's a redesigned fusion of the OG U3 and Pisanta. Also, Pisanta translates to Hound. Vertigo translates to Executioner. So a U3 Pisanta transformation would make sense since OG U3 was Hound-like being a demonic looking creature with its lower half being low to the ground. The top half could look like its normal form, but the bottom half could look like the original U3. Another boss fight we'd like to see is a confrontation between Lord Sadler and Ada. The part where Ada shoots down the statue to stop Sadler from pursuing Leon and Ashley could have Sadler focus his attention onto Ada in having a reimagined boss battle fighting him in his normal state, similar to the OG RE4. Only difference being is that the environment scenery is different. The aftermath could lead into her being used as bait to lure Leon out at the end of the game just like in the original. And that's pretty much everything we'd like to see in the eventual Separate Ways DLC. If you enjoyed, hit that like button, comment down below, and with that being said, have a good day.